Okay, we are back with part two. This time, let me do a proper, like, intro. So, my main goal for what we're doing here is probably to stick to the main missions. If we do come across side missions, then um, we'll probably end up doing them, but I won't go out of my way for, like, side missions and start going off on, like, a tangent, and then, you know, then we'll be going on forever because the universe is huge and uh, there's over a thousand planets in the game so um, what we'll try to do is we'll try to stick to main mission stuff now that we're actually in the game for this episode here to have a visit. Um, we're here Welcome and we to need to introduce yourself to everybody pretty much walk about. around and talk to everybody but we're going to pretty much stay on track with the main missions Why you're and, here um, and he isn't you know if one of the NPCs were I see Dealing Bosco, with has a side mission or something, we'll do it, but made have been... we're not going to go too out of our way hands over for our side shit. shit. Our robot to some random just to kind of finish the game discount um, mining outfit he uses. first and then go back. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols... I'd Anyways, welcome back, guys. This, this is part two of Starfield. This is our gameplay. Neon. But not necessarily an achievement. He's here with the artifact. Thank Walk you, through, but... It's a now, complete gameplay walk. Let's walkthrough, focus so. on what's in front of us, shall we? What happened when it was extracted? Did anyone see anything? We brought here back our artifact. Um, we don't. We actually already talked to this lady here. Uh, we talked to her already. Uh, we said bright lights and music last time. Similar to Barrett's description of the experience, with. Yeah. So anyway, we talked this? to Sarah already. You let's talk to. Me now? Talk to Noel. She's not busy. Wasn't in doubt. Honestly, country. If you expect us to believe in fairy tales. If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, okay. Well, anyways, maybe since I exited the game and came back, it's replaying uh, this part. Gentlemen, can we please? Because we already saw this part here. Noel, I think it's time we tested your theory. Right. Let's see. We know the artifacts react to each other. The pieces we already have move when they're in close contact. Now, if we add this new Ooh, permanently reduces fall damage by 5%. That's awesome. The artifact. If you could place it on the table. Yes, placed it. That's it. Just like that. Yeah, that's a small little oopsie right there. I had backed out and uh um, thought there were only two of them at first. Came back in, so. Oh my god. This that's whole it. animation will happen Look here. How it's coming together. We saw this part already, so if you want to rewatch that part, go look at part one. To end of part one. I'm just gonna loot all this stuff while they're talking here. You'll have a hunt attack. Like I said, there's so much lore in this game. It's like a Fallout. It's like a Skyrim, you know. Um, and pretty much as much as you put into it, that's what you'll get out of it, you know. You pay attention and go and check out all the computer files and all the notebooks and all the books and all the papers and documents then you know you have more of a storyline yeah what are you gonna do about me huh you keep always wanting to get rid of me what are you gonna do with me <laughs> so all right tell me what happens next time. Come find all right, cool. me when you're all right. this is where we left here. off in addition to crap. good morning hooded Good night, NSM. Say good morning to one person, say good night to the other. Okay, so talk to Sarah. I hope Barrett makes it back to us. I know he gets hurt. Are you ready to get to work? I'm ready to get to work. Or something else? Um, I'm ready. We're going to be doing some old-fashioned detective work. That means people okay. can pass them around, not even knowing what they are. I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects. Get back a lot of noise, usually. But a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. The UC Vanguard? A volunteer force that helps defend the edges of United Colonies space. They're always looking for recruits. Lots of retired veterans and dangerous professionals mixed in with part-timers who barely have a laser cannon welded to a hull. My contact is in the recruiting office, so he hears a lot about what the volunteers are up to. Okay. The same way when I started, too. I'm excited. There's an 
electricity in the air when you know you're about to uncover something. But it's not just that. I want to take this opportunity to see how you handle yourself and for you to learn more about us. A I'm test. going to be sticking with you for this. We'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry. Okay. We'll find an artifact and you can come with. We'll need to head to Mast. Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. I should have said no. Listen, I'm going alone. Whatever you were before or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. So long as you don't bring UC security. Every member of Constellation is there. I understand. Let's New Atlantis. Hey, okay, talk to Sarah's contract. That was intense, wasn't it? The art? Yeah, it was very I guess intense. a lot overwhelming. I'm very involved. overwhelming. Something about Planning a place for me to then? stay. Good. I think we can find a spot for you. Oh. Cool. Right. So you've seen the library, obviously. Walter is quite proud of the collection, but Matteo has made more than a few contributions. Oops. <laughs> <coughs> She was going to um show me around and I just left. She was <laughs> What about my place to stay? <laughs> Do we go back in? Well, our objective's that way. Okay, well maybe we should go get our place to stay. Let's go get our place to stay. Oopsies. Let's go back in there. We're here. Perhaps we should check in with Mateo or Noel. I am at your service, Captain. Yeah, where's Noel? My uh. We've always considered ourselves explorers, but this really. Stay safe, okay? Okay, so maybe I do have a spot to stay. I just skipped all of it because that's just what I did. Um. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> New Atlantis. We're outside again. All right. Um. Let's just go to the objective here. I'm sure I have a room there. Take some fall. You have gained an affliction. Um. Uh, affliction. Okay, it wants me to do the affliction thing. Hold on. Where's the affliction? Oh, you have an item. I'm just getting startup official. I'm thinking uh, it's gonna be a big adventure, bro. Oh. Okay, Sarah Morgan. I can't even hop over the fence and you. Oh, I guess I can. Dude, she has hops. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa! Okay, it's. Just... Okay, this is a reminder that Sarah Morgan is crazy. Okay, she's supposed to follow us. Okay, let's go to the objective. She's sticking with us. It's gonna be a big adventure. Yeah, it's gonna be a huge one. Funny, I finished the first episode and then the, uh, the whole game crashed. And we are playing the game now, if you're watching this sometime in the future. This game play is during the second day of release. 
it's not uh, out yet. It's with the premium edition. Sarah, uh, another space explorer. So there might be bugs. Um. Excellent. I'd like Just to join the Vanguard. The an orientation on the UC, a knock out an exam, and a probationary mission. We need to know you'll be able to hack it out there. After. Do well. You'll be up. Don't forget, John. I need him back after you wrap him in that fence. No worry, Sarah. First things first. Head down to the orientation hall. Get signed up at the registration terminal. All right. Let's go get signed up. All right. Right with the UC before we'll let you join. Have some questions? But if you've got any questions, I can get you sorted. The process starts with the Right. Got so wound up bringing you on board, I almost forgot. Yeah, she. <laughs> oh, I haven't. Come on, John. Let's. All right. Here's what I've got. The whole reason why we're here. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. The Sol system. Which admiral did he upset to get that posting? He's Martian, born. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that. Okay. Soul system is a lot of planets, but a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. All right, we're off. Cool. Okay, so um, if you don't see now, this is where we can wait. What? Wait, have official business. We ask you remain in the lobby. Okay, so this is... Okay, so I finished these. Underneath the bar are the finished ones. Above the bar are the unfinished ones. This is a side mission, and these aren't our main mission. This is our main mission. Okay, so let's go and do the side mission. Um, let's go register for the Vanguard here. How is the uh, the character customization, bro? It's so in depth. Yeah, character customization is so in depth, Jake. It's um, I didn't want to spend too much time on it, just for, you know, for the video's sake. But um, yeah, you could spend a lot of time on that. And there's a whole class and and like trait thing. You choose three traits. Orientation hall. Let's go. We're going to get a orientation. Wait, 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 wait. I'm here for orientation. First day of school. Hello. I've probably got every display in this place memorized at this point. <laughs> this game just predicted the end of the world, bro. <laughs> In 2050, the earth exploded. <laughs> I remember that one. <laughs> so in 2050, this game predicts someone's going to launch a nuke. Hey, man. Well, not a nuke, but I'm assuming. I mean, I mean, unless unless the world just explodes. Okay, the history of war. Oh, don't let me. That pension doesn't go as far as it used to. But wandering around down here with a cup of coffee, there are 
far worse ways to spend a couple hours. The were left untouched by the colony war. But you nowhere know it was could the viciousness of modern warfare be seen more clearly than on the Free Star Trek. What do you mean? Access denied. All right, cool. Thought I was here from my uh... transformed into scorched husks. No one a nightmarish testament to the depths of human ingenuity and human cruelty. And today, beginning in 2240, House Baroon forces declared all out war on the rest of human civilization. One of the terminals. My family never had a terminal here. And independent souls were killed by agents of House Varun in the name of their serpent god. It was only with the death of their founder in 2263 and the succession of his heir, Jared, that House finally served for peace. No terminal here. Did you register for the Vanguard? The goal of all space. Uh, no, but I think there's an achievement link to it, so you can do it. Oh, there it is, dude. <laughs> All right, cool. All right. I, mad, do not agree. All right, let's complete the orientation, go down the hall, and now I can take my flight thing, pilot simulation. of time in simulators just like these. They're startlingly realistic. Have fun. Oops. Hi, Exam Proctor. Ah, you must be our new applicant. I'm Proctor Samuelson. The simulator's already been prepped. Of course. You'll be... Your task is to defeat at least... However, and your enlistment bonus, but you're welcome to yeah. try... We'll only keep the height. Just head in whenever you're ready. No man's sky. We're entering the simulation. But aren't we already in a simulation? We're in an inception of simulations. Simulation inception. This is the Mark 18 flight simulation chamber applicant. Okay. Currently in Put orbit around the pilot seat, boy. Of a remote world. When you're ready to begin, please take a seat in the pilot's chair. Your exam is simple. Defeat as many tiers of opponents as you can before your ship is disabled. You must defeat at least three tiers of opponents to pass the exam. Good hunting, applicant. Your target's active. Yeah, the ship's not heat-seeking. Your 
Fox do not. Like, all of them. My ship's so loud. Got him. All targets eliminated. Woo! Progress recorded. Tier one reached. Initiating tier two. Bring it on. New targets active. between like space combat and then normal combat like on the ground Yeah, so when you're on the ground combat, it's either or. You get to choose first or third person. You guys will be seeing here in probably a few minutes. Yeah, it's really cool that you could choose. I didn't even realize you could do it in space, bro. Wow. Hey! There we go. All targets eliminated. Progress recorded. There we go. Congratulations, applicant. You've defeated sufficient opponents to pass the exam. You may now exit the simulator through the hatch. What if I don't want to leave? Or stay and try your hand at the remaining tiers. on third person in the space. Resuming the examination. New targets active. All right. Yeah, I'll resume the simulation. Bring it on. Oh, shoot. Pretty sure I died. Okay, yeah, no, we'll uh, we'll back out of this. Let me check. Is there an achievement tied to like the trials in this simulation? Yeah, join the UC Vanguard. Seems honestly like not that bad of an achievement list. Seems like very doable and 
relatively fast for the kind of game that this is. Obviously, no one has it within the first couple of days, but... Alright, uh... Damn, someone's gotten it already. Uh... Yeah, they Probably got it all done in one day, though, so I don't know. Yeah, sure. I want to join the Vanguard. Yeah. Congratulations, applicant. You've passed. You can head up to Commander Tuwala to receive your final results and your probationary assignment. Or you're welcome to take another run at the simulation if you'd like to try and earn a better score. I don't need a better score. I'm... I was flawless up there. Official United Colonies business can access the I wanted to talk to. Hey! Well, look who's back. Everything go all right? Ah, so these are your numbers that just came through then. I'm ready. Sir, yes, sir. I like the fire applicant. Let's get into it. So, looking at the data, checked out a few of the murals. Inquisitive folks tend to do well around here. Psychological results are all within expected levels. Navy doesn't have room for folks that'll fall apart the first time they're trying to outrun a homing missile. Now, how'd you do against your foes? All right, clear tier three. We try to set a high bar, so that's no small feat. Nice work. Hell of a job. I might even let you fly me around sometime. Tier three? That was nothing. So then, looking at your results as a whole, it was ten years service. Better than your average lab rat or diplomat. But pretty standard for folks going out into combat. Ten years might seem like a long time, but it's worth the climb if you wish to become a citizen. So, sounds hey, like snacky with the big raid right over here on kick. If you're interested, Thanks, man. we could bring you on as a provisional member today. Get you the credits you've earned, then send you out on your purpose. First, though, all UC service people, provisional I or just otherwise, cause. are required to swear an oath. So. You want to make this official? Commit yourself to the cause of the colony? Yes, it's I want to make this decision. official. John, you're not about to have my compatriot here sign some kind of contract that sells you their grandmother five years down the line, are you? Officer's honor, Sarah. This is honest work for honest credits. So, you ready to do the deed? Well, are we doing the deed? Can we do this under the table? I like to operate independently. I'm gonna have you wait for a while for my answer, so you. I don't know. All right. Okay. Um. I'm ready. Fantastic. I'm always ready. Let's go. time since I've been to Mars. Okay. I didn't mean to trade you. Oh, oh okay. That's not... Wouldn't be right doing this where we couldn't see the stars. Now, raise your right hand. Raise your right hand. The motto of the Vanguard is Supra et Ultra. Super Above et and beyond. Ultra. That is where we serve. Beyond the furthest reaches of the United Colonies military. And with honor and duty above reproach. Do you swear to protect and defend the citizens of the United Colonies to the best of your abilities? And to uphold the values of the Vanguard 
Honor, loyalty, self-reliance in all your actions as a member of the United Colonies Navy? Hmm. On second thought, let me think about it. I do! Then let me be the first to officially welcome you to the United Colonies Vanguard. Thank you, brother. Now, only thing left is getting you that probationary mission. And what I've got is comms repair. Group trying to refurb an old colony war processing plan on Tau City 2. Sounds like they'd barely gotten set up when their communications died. Place is as isolated as they come. So, so can the people of Tau City 2 count on you? No. That's the spirit. Head down to the spaceport and talk. Oh, and your advance. Give it your all out there. My Super advance. Super Ultra. Are available. Let's go spend our skill points. So we have physical. Social. Persuasion. We're gonna trick somebody? Let's see. Oh yeah, my lasers do more damage as well. from any of the tiers of the skills straight off the bat. Yeah. I got, like I could go in, oh no, it's still locked. Oh, you can't, Never mind. Yeah, no, you can't. Yeah, top down. I wonder if you are able to respect your skills. Do you see an option to somewhere? No, I didn't. I guess I haven't really looked. Pistol certification. I'm just checking these badges stream because I haven't checked through them before. Pretty much all the skills. Ship thrusters. Ooh. Boost packs. Targeting control systems. I should help. Yep. 
Yeah, that's gonna help us with combat a lot. So we need to make sure to be in targeting mode. We have one more skill point to spend for now. Um, Finished. Sergeant Yumi is looking for reliable people. To oh, help started, I mean. Contact him if you're interested. We'd all appreciate it. Am I able to get down there from there? Yeah. It's a little awkward that the Y button is jump, but I might actually remap it. Yeah, that's how Skyrim and Fallout is. It interacts with the Y button, then, right? <laughs> I would switch that. Probably, to yeah. Which I don't mind. I think that's probably better for me. across most of the settled systems in all manners of spacecraft, and yet I still get sick on the NAT. Oh, I've always liked... So just a quick reminder what, uh, for what we're doing here. We are doing a... I think we were going to do... Oh, okay, now we got activities. Okay. Yeah, so I guess there is no, like main missions per se I mean there probably is like maybe like milestone missions you know like once you do it it's like a, you know it's like a big event, big deal big event but for the most part it's just pretty much where you go probably like because now I'm in the United Colonies and I got this mission it's I mean, there, it's technically a side mission but there might be side missions within the United Colonies but anyways, um, let's just keep going. I don't know which one we're that doing statue. here or which one the cursor is showing me or leading me to. Let's. Oh, we can fast travel. Okay, let's see what this Deck. does. Oops, let's let's take let's get out of here. Hold on. Yeah, I probably shouldn't. Yeah. Oh no, that was good. All right, cool. Damn, I'm running out of oxygen. To limp back here at all. Pull it for leeches, get it fixed up, and let her know we'll have it ready as soon as we can. Ah, you are new. It's my job to make sure all you rocket jockeys are ready for rocket anything that jockeys. comes at you up there. Now, manifest. In addition to the standard med pack, some small arm, my people will have everything on your ship before you lift off. Won't even know they were there. Hmm. So, nice easy one for your first job. Je any questions before you head out? What exactly are you putting Nothing on my too ship? dangerous, if that's your concern. The repair suite's mostly just wiring and circuit boards. I'm all set. Then I won't keep you. Make us look good out there. Just getting 
contact. Again, just to be clear, we are doing the grunt work mission. That's the one that's active. All right. Hi, Dark. Let's take off. I'm liking it, I'm liking it. It's been a minute since I've played a game like this. But um, I'm getting the hang of things. It's uh, only been about, I'd say about two and a half hours so far. That way. Okay. Gonna press X. Power up grab drive. Oh. Okay, so we keep the engine on, we turn off the lasers and the missiles. Gonna grab the all the way. Oh, don't even have to turn it up all the way. But yeah, I'm liking, I'm liking it a lot, man. The more you get into it, the more you'll like it. Alright, let's land. See if we could find some extra goodies over here. trying it on game pass in a few days yeah yeah I'm lucky to be playing it right now the game did crash on me once I'm not playing it through game pass obviously I'm playing it through the license An abandoned but, meat packing you know facility it might be a little buggy the first couple days systems. Okay, let me change the settings right now because the jump is Y, and I want to change that. Uh, controls. I might have to do... Oh, never mind. Here's binding. Oh, see, this was easy. What's the conflict? 
Oh. Main game play outpost. Where's it say outpost? Jump. Build. Confirm. Oh. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. I'm on Xbox, yeah. Oh. Okay. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Got him. Hey, there we go. Yeah, I'm playing on Xbox Series X at the moment. Yeah, the controls are, uh, I mean, that right there just fixed everything for me. A little choppiness, but I don't. Not, An abandoned meat not, I'm not, I'm not upset about it. Fringes of the settled systems. Let's go and investigate this scream, guys. Are you got some incredible timing? Regardless, I think it knows you're here. Yeah. the door. In the first episode that I just recorded it, be quiet. Uh, we didn't get through as much content as we'll be getting through in this second one. Now that we're a lot more familiar with the controls and the game. Um, alright. We want to get as much. Health and resources as we can take. Maybe not pick up junk as much as uh, pick up better things like which in this ammo case. And maybe what's over here? Nope. Locker, like what's in here? How about this one? I'll take them pills. Who knows when they'll become useful. We'll take some shotgun bullets. Okay, um, another thing I want to check is how much uh, mass. Eek. It says I'm at 134 out of 135 mass. So I'm... I think right at my my limit here. Okay, so watch if I if I grab this and I grab this. Watch, I'll take a couple more things and it'll say I can't take it. That. What was that, Loki? The over encumberness. It's not as bad as other games. You can have like a hundred more pounds on you, and you'll. You're not going to like pretty agile move super slow. You can still you still move as fast as you normally do. You just uh, you lose O2 faster. That's all it is. <laughs> and you can't fast travel if you're over encumbered. Just kinda... So what do we got here? It's too clean to be one of the settlers. Vanguard, huh? Yeah, I expect they didn't. I'm Hadrian. I'm a... I was a researcher with the UC. I, I came here on a rumor of a... Well, I, it's... What's left of the settlers? The work of Oxisio Machina. One of the nastiest aliens you know. You're not going to give me any spoilers, but you will one, give me a little tip that stealing an ships anomaly. and selling them gets Possibly you pretty good money. One. I can't believe that a terror. Need to go be hijackers. Sound like you could use my help. I sure could. Because to confirm my suspicions about this creature, I'm gonna need a tissue sample from it. And to get that. All right, we need the corpse. The cool. admin terminal's here in this building, but it needs its connection reset. But if you can make it to the security outpost. All right, let's Good. go to the security Once outpost. Once I see the connection reset, take care of yourself out there and make sure you leave it. All right, I'll try, I'll try. All right. Let's 
go, let's go. Yeah, so in this gameplay, we will, over time, try to get all of the Xbox achievements. But, for right now, we're not going to really have that be that much of a worry. I don't believe, from what I skimmed through, that any of them are missable. I might be wrong, but I don't, I don't think any of them are. But I'll take a better look at to that stuff later. Reset the connection. Connection restored. I'll make this quick. Hmm. Plants turrets took a beating. But I should be able to get you a couple of kill lanes. Just get the thing to chase you down the alleys between I'll the be buildings, that. and you'll lead it right into a crossfire. Then make it quick. Hello. I wish I'd found this earlier. You notice those sensors around the facility? Part of a livestock tracking system. Should let you keep tabs on how close the Terramorph is. It's not connected to this network. There should be a terminal in the adjoining room. Tune it to 183.5. Tune it. Wow, that's crazy. Two years on the stream following. Thanks, man. Still going strong, too. Trackers reading green. What's that sound? Security lockdown is active. Shit. Stop. Stop whatever you're doing and get in cover. It's on the move. Seeing a meat packing facility from the inside is starting to make me feel like I should switch to become a vegetarian. Gonna make you pay.
this stuff. Hey, sucker, where you at? I shouldn't have blown up that one that I shot. Yeah, we're fucking this thing up. Colony. Huh. Might as well take what we can. So, like, for example, see, I didn't do the optional objectives. So, is there achievements tied to doing optional objectives? That's the question. No, I don't think there is. It's just XP related. Gives you more rewards and shit. Yeah. Access 50 computers, that's one. Yeah. No, literally it's, there's no missables on this shit. No, just <clears throat> play and enjoy it. Oh, I'm doing right now. Black Ops grinds? Yeah, back in the day. Trekker's gone quiet. I suspect it's either... Wait. You did it, didn't you? Yeah, we flattened it, man. <laughs> oh, yeah. Taken care of. No big deal. <laughs> you didn't happen to... A lot of life gets recorded in our cells. Like, for example, if this Terramorph's cells have certain radiation or chemical exposures, then True. we could start getting some answers about this thing. All right. I spotted a microscope downstairs. Let's see if we can't get to the bottom of this. Downstairs. Okay. Uh, yeah, I definitely need to go and oh, Frankenstein. If you're overloaded, we should stop and prioritize what we're carrying. Don't tell me what to do and how to live my life. Ah, oh, you're right. I was just gonna say I need to sell my stuff. Okay. A bottle. Microscope. Do I want to carry that around? No. The succulents. Do I want the? No, I don't want the succulents or the surgical bowl. 
The soil box. I could sell that. Utility knife, you gotta go. Pen, you gotta go. Notebook, why do I need that? Get out of here. Notebook, notebook, notebook. all this this equipment it's not set up to do a proper humanity's spread plenty of creatures in our travels across the stars but terramorphs they're different to our knowledge no one's ever spread them intentionally so when humans settle a world 70 to 100 years later terramorphs tend to just appear no one knows how or why dangerous but at least predictable. Tal said he... But then the other option... That some... That seems awfully implausible. Which means... We're either looking at a truly strange murder... Or a faster type of terramorph growth. Terramorph outbreaks have taken down far bigger colonies than this one. You're right. We just need more information first. Time was, I had access to one of the best repositories of Terramorph research in the galaxy. Seems a natural, but we also need to. Luckily, what would you say? Yeah, I'd do it myself. Plus, clear it with your commander for. You can right, even show them. Stuff to do. Oh, you don't understand. I need Doctor. I'm not sure. There's a place called the Sixth Circle in Sidonia. Bar run by some old friends. I'll meet the you and Percival Circle there. In Sidonia. And here. Now, please go check in with your commander. We need to know what we're dealing with. So she's got hops. Or from earlier. Yeah, I believe it was earlier. She, she's got hops. Okay, we need our health pack. Another one. Captain? 
Where are we headed next? We probably could have teleported or fast traveled back to our ship. I forgot about that. Looking for a specific planet. Oh, is that what that is right here? No, that's not our objective. Looking for our objective here. I remember the name. It's like Cold Coldera. Alright, let me see. She just told us where we have to go. Oh no, see that's for that mission. We're talking about... They're all right here. Okay. Both both missions lead me to like the same spot, I believe. But yeah, this game is gonna get nuts. Right now it doesn't seem like much, but there's that mission tab is going to get overwhelming fast with missions and other missions and other missions and side missions and missions. Whew. All right, well, let's go and wrap these two missions up that we have here, both in this spot. Let's go up here. And I really want to sell some stuff. And to be clear before I approach the person uh, at the desk um, the mission that we're wrapping up is called grunt work from the United Colonies look who's back all set with that probationary mission we can do your debrief and formally welcome you into the Vanguard a terror what how did you walk away with the terror morph you killed a terramorph on your first mission. If I could be frank for a moment, holy shit. Above and beyond doesn't really begin to describe holy it, does it? Holy shoot. You earned yourself. But uh, if none of the settlers made it, a researcher. Let me see that. Hmm, Sanan. I know that name. Let me check the database. Huh. <laughs> Here we go. Co-head of a UC Xeno Weapons Division. Guess that's why I'd heard the name before. Certainly seems that way. It's urgent. Your survivor, Hadrian. She mentioned why she thinks this sample's so special. 
She's not sure. I, I see. He is not sure. This uh, has been one of the more surprising debriefs I've ever been a part of. I did actually have Me another too. mission lined up for you, supporting UC system defense against the Crimson Fleet. But now I guess you have two options on how to proceed. Head to the UC Vigilance and help out SysDef, or deliver that sample. I'll make sure you've got the proper clearances for either path. Consider these your first official orders. And here, so everyone knows you're working with the Vanguard. Welcome to the Navy, Captain. Vanguard's also got some custom ship modifications. You'll be cleared for access to them next time you're down at the spaceport. Talk to ship services. Now, if there wasn't anything else, I'd suggest nice. you move out. Yeah! We joined the Vanguard. Oh, a second achievement. Reach level five. You see that scientist out in front of Mast? Staring at trees, sounds upset. Whatever it is, this it is can't awesome, be that bad, guys. right? Here we go. Dance, dance, dance. We're gonna bag it up. Bag it up. Oh. So now if we check our missions here, this option. Um, I think we have two choices. Yeah, so we finished the grunt work. Nice. Okay, so we can either do the deep cover Crimson Fleet mission or we can um, do this delivering devils mission. This is, I think, the two options we have. Let's see, so where do I go to go sell stuff again? The dude told me down the ramp he has a shop. But I think I forgot where that was. Industrial outpost? Uh, there's like... Um, like terminals, I would say. They're like okay. greenish, I believe. Yeah, it'll be like right next to your ship, pretty much. Should be somewhere near your ship. This space is a memorial to those lost during the This, tell me how many. Sleeping on your ship gives you a boost. Nice. I don't know. Yeah, I'm sure if you had the family thing, there would be a home here. Or uh, some well rested. I slept. I just slept for 10 hours and I got 24 minutes of plus 10% XP gain. It's amazing right. to think that this tree predates New Atlantis. Mm. Can you imagine all the changes it's seen? Where's my ship? I'm gonna be able to see my ship through the... I just wanna fast travel to my ship. Oh, there it is. No, Sarah, get out of my way, Sarah Morgan. I don't wanna fast travel to you. But it sure is rewarding. Oh, I'm cumbersome. Okay, yeah, let me... I'm over cumber. Let me...
we gotta start. Need to be one thirty five. With the weapons, let me get rid of some weapons. No. sell any of that. Or I don't want to just drop it. Um, my ship is where? I have to. I have to. I have to. The struggles of playing games where you can't hold stuff, man. We can fast travel. <laughs> Damn. Alrighty. Uh, left bumper. Our ship. Fast travel. Yes. Yay! We did it. Okay. Exit ship. Okay, I'm assuming she should see some of trade the kiosk. There we go. Could sell and buy it back. Got to keep a rescue axe just in case. Okay, so, um, I 
So what did we just do? So we just joined the frontier. Um, I'll show the missions. Oops. We just finished grunt work. And now we have the option to either do delivering devils or deep cover. I think we're going to probably go hit some space, uh, some space battles and do the, the Crimson Fleet. But we're going to do that in the next episode. I'm going to end this episode here and we will continue in the next one where we will do deep cover. And um, yeah, we just got two achievements. Let's just go show these real quick. Um, joined the, the UC Vanguard, which was pretty much the, the grunt work. And then we reached level five. So we're on to some f space battles into episode three. And um, make sure to subscribe to the channel. I appreciate all the support on YouTube. Really helps me out a lot as a content creator. I'll see you guys in the next episode where we do deep cover.